Hi, this is Vladan from vladan.fr. I'm going to show you today the installation of uh, Microsoft Windows Server 2012 R2, the preview release on uh, VMware vSphere 5.1 update to 1. So it's nothing fancy. We're just going to create this guy. New virtual machine. Windows 2012 R2. We're going to put it on the NFS. Choose 2012 64-bit. One CPU, four gigs of RAM, the Nixnet 3, the Synergic SAS, new virtual disk, okay, okay, edit, and here we're going to attach the CD, ROM, or the ISO. I've already downloaded the ISO and I upload it to my data store. It's four gigs file. You can see the name is quite long. Here we go. It's a DVD. Okay, and connect it when we start the VM. Okay, now I'm going to pause the video. I've already created the VM and attached the ISO file. <coughs> Connect it. And um, 4 gigs of RAM, options, Windows, Windows Server 2012 64-bit. Okay. <clears throat> Let's power it on. Can go full screen. French keyboard. Okay, I just pasted the temporary serial number for the pre preview release of, um, and we're going to choose the serial with the GUI. Accept custom installation next. So it's gonna start copy the files and all this. So I'm gonna pause the video and uh, gonna come back when it finish. Okay, we are back. So um, the installer has uh, brought me here. So I need to enter a new password. Put full screen. Twenty twelve R two. Excellent. So while we're here, I'm gonna install 
VMware Tools. and reboot. Okay, so we got the IP address from our DHCP server. We got the VMware tools running. It's VM version number eight, and we have a one CPU, four gigs of RAM, and we have a nicely running Windows Server 2012 R2. Okay, got it. So when you go to the properties of the taskbar you get the navigation tab. On the start screen you can check this, go to the desktop instead of a start. This also should be apps. Well, kind of, how I do log off, log off, oh, sign out, okay, that's it, thank you for watching, bye bye.